Hello my dear students and welcome to Inj 102 Unit 11 Lesson 4 Study and Writing Skills. By the end of this lesson you will be able to first identify why and when people write reports. Read for guests for just for specific information. Use to and enough and the second conditional. Analyze why reports are, or, are, are organized. Explore useful words and phrases used in reports. Now, let us see this newsletter. Let us read it together and then we will try to answer these questions. Dear employees, as you all know, the whole world is now fighting virus COVID-19. It is a pandemic that we all have to be aware of and careful not to contact it. The government has been working nonstop to keep us all safe and to contain this vacuous virus. Now the next paragraph, one of the government's approaches is encouraging working from home by utilizing digital resources available in order to limit social interactions as much as possible. Now the next paragraph, therefore, we would like you to set up a plan for your task and a timeline to achieve them from home. You are required to submit weekly reports on the work done. Out of shared responsibility, we would also like to encourage you to volunteer in the teams fighting this virus. We will be making informative reflects for our campaign to raise awareness on how to stay safe during this difficult time and your help is appreciated. Thank you, Mohammed. Now, after reading this, uh, this newsletter, let us try to answer these questions. Actually, if you are trying to understand a newsletter or a report, try to ask as much questions as possible. So these are some examples of the questions. One of the questions can be, for example, where did the text appear? Who wrote the text? Why did they write this text? And who will read the text? So as I said, answering these questions can help us a lot to understand the report. What are reports? Read and fill the gaps with the correct word from the box. We have here five words, something, make, influence, accept, and information. Okay. Now we'll try to match uh, the words here. Reports are documents which both give a reader blank and ask the reader to do blank with the information. Reports can be used to suggest new ideas and options, to ask people to blank a point of view, to blank decisions, to ask people to blank choices between alternative recommendations. Now, I'll give you some time to think about the right answer. Now, let us see. The first one will be information. Very good. The second one, something. And third one, accept, influence, and make. Very good. Who needs to write a report? Workers of all kinds and students write reports on a daily basis. It's an important skill to have and practice. Notes on how to write a report. Okay, first, a report will usually follow a simple format that can be identified over and over again. Two, use headings, subheadings, bullet, uh, bullet points. Three, remember to use full sentences and new paragraphs for new ideas or parts. Four, the format may be influenced by the purpose and length of the report. Steps for steps of writing a report. As you see, we have five main steps that can help us 
to understand how can we write a report, a short one. First, the title. Second, the introduction. Third, discussion, recommendations, and finally, conclusions and summary. This is a sample of a report. And as you see, the title is A Plan for a New Airport. Try to read it. Okay, now we'll try to find out where the title, the introduction, the discussion, the recommendations, the conclusions, and summary. Okay, so where is the title here? I guess it's clear. Uh, a plan for a new airport is the title. Very good. And the introduction? That comes always at the beginning. Why we said this paragraph is an introduction? Because it gives us a general idea of what's going to be discussed here and also uh, the main idea. The main idea or the aim of the report. Third, we have here the discussion. Why it's a discussion? Because we write more about the uh, topic, more information. We discuss it in more depth. And the recommendation. How did we know that this is a recommendation? And also it can help you when you are trying to write your own reports. We see here we do recommend. When you see we do recommend, it is a recommendation. So you can follow the same format. And finally, the conclusion. And how did we know the conclusion? To sum up, this is a word that can give you a, that can give you a hint to know the conclusion. Okay. In your notebook, write a short report and choose one of the following topics. One, suspending schooling during COVID-19 outbreak. Two, smoking and its effect on health. Three, social media and its influence on society. Thank you for your attention and see you soon.